What? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What? What's up, video Tasta going today? Dak Blake here, and today we're playing Captain Warrington's Play Maze. That's right, this is a brand new game. It's a new game day today, and it's by the same developer as uh, the, the Man from the Window. So it's essentially kind of like a Man from the Window game. <laughs> I guess it's more of a Man from the Play Maze game, which sounds strange, but I think you can see him back there. He's like a pirate or something. He's like, ah! <laughs> So I'm excited. We haven't had a Z Technician game in a long time. And I'm always excited for these games because there's so much story, but there's also so much stress. So I have no idea what to expect. We're gonna try to break it. We're gonna find some glitches. Let's have some fun. All right, the game is beginning. I always love to do voices for the characters. So we got we gotta get into some, some characters here. So this is, a, okay, the character is Betty Ann. I'll try a Southern accent. I feel like I'm so bad with accents, but you know what? It's worth a try. So Southern. Now, that wasn't half bad. <laughs> that was bad. All right, so now I've committed to a southern accent. <laughs> the order was right. The food was hot. It even looks like they've remodeled the place since last time. How was yours, Albert? Albert? Oh, yeah. <laughs> what if we just gave Albert, like, a completely different voice that no one would ever expect? He's just like, great. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny. Ah, uh, okay. If you keep those grades up, yours will come back next week. Okay? Okay. <laughs> Good. <laughs> now then, we'll still have much, much more to do this evening. And Pan's always like, Mother, why do we have very different voices <laughs> from each other? I think the mall is safe this week, so we'll swing by there next. Safe? What does that mean? She says, then we'll go grocery shopping. Uh. What is it, dear? <laughs> do you hear something? Oh. Something like what? It's uh, uh, nothing. N never mind. Well, if you hear it again, let me know. I'm going to head to the bathroom before we leave, so be right back. I don't know what to expect here, but uh, <laughs> okay. There he is. There's Captain Warrington in the background. Is he just standing there? What? The tunnel? But uh, I'm not supposed to leave without her. Really? I guess so. What is he talking to? to the thing oh wait it's just a statue all right hi what this is the creepiest thing i have ever seen so um this is the game we have now begun we are in captain warrington's play maze it kind of just looks like a burger king play zone right does it not so maybe i can climb in here oh i can okay whoa this goes way deeper than i thought it would hold on it's kind of scary should i be looking like behind me this is deep, what? <laughs> this is kinda cool. Uh, oh, an arrow. What happens if I go the other way? Oh man, you know me. I have to go this way now. <laughs> okay, it's just a dead end. I was like, man, I have to go the wrong way. We're okay, I gotta go down the wrong way again. Gotta do it. Nope, nothing. Okay, it's been like forever now. How, how like far is this tube going? Okay. Wait a minute, no way. No way this leads into the same area. What? What is going on? Uh, okay. It's kind of like I just entered a different dimension. Hold on, I'll be Albert. Who, who goes there? Where, where are you? Mom, Captain Warrington. Oh wait, there he is. Hi, how's it going there? Oh, I could hear you much better now. Why do I feel like the villain? <laughs> Albert, I could hear you much better now. Come on. <laughs> What were you trying to tell me? Oh, so, oh, what? Okay, it, it just faded. What's happening now? So what would Ashley have as a voice? Sure, I, I, I'll give him the drink. <laughs> it's so bad. I need milk, sugar, ice, then chocolate. The dude wanted milk, sugar, ice, then vanilla. So yeah, I messed up. I can admit when I do something wrong. I have remade the stupid thing, no problem. No questions asked, but do you know what he did? What did he do? He flipped the whole tray over on me. The drink, the fries, everything. Oh, come on, that's awful. Uh-huh, and I had to change my uniform and everything. Oh man, wait, where were these people when I was walking around? So, naturally I threw down the garbage disposal and then, wait, what? Someone opened the maze door. That's like saying, oh no, some kid played in the play pit. They weren't supposed to do that. That was just there for no purpose. So, um, we have to figure out who's gonna go in. Since I kind of gave a voice to, uh, Ashley. Oh, wait, they have, like, um, they have, like, perks? 
Ashley is faster than Penny. No penalty for wrong answers due to mental fortitude. Okay. What is, is the manager? How does that give you... Maybe there's like a secret ending, I, I bet you. You know, I have to go with Ashley, I think still. To be able to like, no penalty from wrong answers, I feel like I'm gonna get things wrong. All right, so we're gonna have to go in after the kid. I kind of <laughs> I kind of already forgot his name. W what was his name? <laughs> He's just kid number one to Ashley, right? So it says time passes differently inside the maze. Set the stopwatch for 12 minutes, shift it into high gear and locate the next exit before time expires. You must reach six before he does what oh 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 okay what what am i supposed to do it is counting down so fast so we're gonna have to determine which are dead ends but we are faster so that was the whole perk of being penny okay so we're here did we make it okay you will exit the tunnel in a seemingly familiar place but this is not your warrington location the way forward is barred there is a key on the main counter retrieve it and continue forwards into the maze Okay, this is so creepy. Oh man. Oh, I see it. It's just one. Hi there, buddy. How's it going? Your teeth are coming in really nice. Got a good six teeth, no bottom ones. <laughs> okay, so this is like a like a different dimension. This would be so creepy to see. Oh, okay, so there's a letter. It says Warrington. All management staff be advised. Due to declining profit margins, major changes have been approved by the board and CEO. Much research was conducted and many potential problems were brought up, including recent steep prices, increases, declining food quality, and semi-ethical ingredient sources. After careful deliberation, the decision has been made to create a company mascot in order to address these issues. Signed, the Warring Burger Corporation. So they made a mascot, the creepiest mascot I've ever seen. They made a mistake. You know, honestly, if you're going to make a mascot for kids, that wasn't the right one. Look at this. He's like, hey kids, you want a hamburger? Come on, <laughs> I'll hit you if you don't want one. All right, well, let's continue forward. Uh, I have little time, gotta go. Oh, okay, here we go. I don't know where the decisions are, but it seems like, what is this? Okay, maybe it's red, red, I put it here. There we go. Okay, not too bad. I think that was just to slow me down. I gotta stop talking. I gotta just go. I gotta think. I gotta be instinctual, you know? Oh, man. Okay, okay, okay. I made it. Do I have to get another key or do I go through? It is another key. Okay. Got the key. Does this say? Okay. After extensive analysis of current trends, our PR team has drafted a pirate-themed design for our new company mascot. A prototype model of this design is scheduled to be built within the following weeks. After approval by our marketing team and ethics division, design blueprints will be sent to every eligible Warrington location. Instructions on the proper outsourcing channels for construction will be provided as necessary. Signed, the Warring Burger Corporation. So, I guess the marketing team failed. <laughs> Also, there was like an ethics division. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay. Whoa. Hey, hey, I'm going to get this close to you to make you feel uncomfortable. All right. Can I annoy him? I'm just going to put my clipboard right there into his mouth. Yeah. Taste that. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Okay. So this is good so far. I like it. I think we can do this. I wonder because I know that a lot of times when I play Zed Technician games, I always fail. Like at the, re the very end, it gets really complicated. Nine divided by three. Okay. Uh, three. Let's go. I didn't know I had to do math. It was like Baldi's basics over here. Ah, where do I go? I don't know. I had to make a decision. I don't know which one was a dead end or not. Oh man. This is a very large dead end if I found it. I don't have a lot of time left. It, it can't be a dead end. <gasps> I barely made it. Okay. All right. Oh, he's not even here now. Oh, great. Oh, hi there. Hi, how's it going? You're kind of blocking me, buddy. W what? Look at him, just standing in the dark. He's not creepy at all. He's got a very wonderful smile. Just think of him as like a very happy old grandpa. He's just like, ha <laughs> ha, how's it going? Ah, I'm a grandpa. <laughs> All right, got the key. Oh, hey, hi, yeah, I heard you, I heard you. He's pointing at it, what, what does it say? I'll read it. The prototype design was approved by our marketing team with a unanimous vote of 12-0 in favor? The ethics division attempted to halt progress by voting not to approve the design, citing extreme moral and safety concerns. The design was subsequently overruled by both the CEO and board, and the design has been approved for use in all locations. The materials needed for the construction of a Captain Warrington statue, wood-based bone and ash-based paints, and replica clothing will be provided as necessary. They just created a monster. Hi there. 
All right, so we're only three out of six. It's only gonna get great beer, but I'm excited. I wanna see, I wanna see him running around. I wanna see if I can glitch him out. If he does chase you, I feel like I could find a way to break it. Okay, this looks complicated. What is this? What, what? Uh, I don't, okay, I honestly have no clue what this is. What am I supposed to do? Like, uh, what? Oh wait, set the numbers in order. One through nine or nine through one. Oh man, ah, one, okay. Uh, ah, ah, two, <laughs> this is so hard. Three, four, uh, ah, I went over. Five, six, seven. Oh man, I, oh my gosh, that's gonna be the death of me. There we go. Oh my gosh, that took so long. Maybe I could just breeze through these next ones. And now that I know that puzzle, I can do it better next time. Also, it's okay. If I lose, I get to see the little jump scare animation or something, right? I have no clue. Oh no, it's counting down so fast. Okay, I'm doing it again, but this time I'm doing it in reverse order. Um, there we go. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this. <gasps> I did it, I made it. Okay, so number four, he's around here somewhere. Where are you, Captain Warrington? I am ready. Where are you? Hi, oh, you're just standing right here? Hi, can I just leave? Oh, there is no outside anymore. All right, let's see what's happening now. According to this month's financial report, all locations that have added a Captain Warrington statue have experienced record profits. As projected, the use of bone and ash-based paint in combination with a Gretel wood base result in subtle mind and space altering effects. When in close proximity to a Captain Warrington statue, customers are observed to buy more food than normal. Customers have also been noted to return more frequently than usual. Some locations have even reported the sudden appearance of a large and colorful tube maze. Signed, the Warring Burger Corporation. All right, where are you now? So he is not even here anymore. I don't even see him. So we're just gonna get going. That I mean, that's kind of creepy that I don't know where he is, but let's just go. See, I don't know if either of you guys are very tuned in. You know, you're watching. Do you feel the stress with me? Or you're kind of like, haha, Dak Blake is stressed. <laughs> Time is running down. That's not good, but we're running. You know, what else can we do? Oh, we made it, easy. So it says, I used to work on the ethics division before corporate dissolved it. Corporate can't be trusted. They've all been blinded by greed and gotten mad with power. Mind control is not an acceptable practice for a burger franchise. It does mind control. We haven't figured out a way to stop the captain statues, but their effectiveness can be reduced. Move the captain into the play maze room and put a no entry sign on the door. This will reduce his influence to only children, the elderly, and apparently clergymen. He will try to lure them into his maze and whatever you do, do not let them bring someone into the supply closet further inside the maze. Signed, the whistleblower. Okay, where are you? Where are you? No, 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 no. Can I, can, do I not have? Maybe I, oh, maybe the manager was only allowed to do that. I can't do anything. No, stop. All right, well, you know what? I can't do anything. I guess we just gotta go. And going, going. All right, I made it. Okay, so this should be the last one, right? So keep your eyes and ears open. We gotta see everything. What is going on? All right, all right, where are you? Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Come with me, come with me. Hey, you, 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 you. Finally, there you are, kid. Hey, snap out of it. Huh? Where am I? <laughs> I'm still doing the voice. Well, what was I doing? You're about to follow a pirate into the supply closet. I shouldn't have to explain to you why that's a bad idea. Right, I'm I'm sorry. Happens, I, I guess. Now, come on, I'm taking you back to your mama. Okay. So it says, by the way, I found the key in there earlier here. Okay, so yeah, he gave me the key, which means that we can leave, but where, where is he? Did he leave? Wait, what? I'm guessing he just went ahead. Okay, well, here is the moment of truth. I think we have to go back now? Oh no, it's closed. So it's, yeah, it's just through here again. All right, okay, timer is starting. Oh, this time, I don't know if something is chasing me, but it kind of feels like something is chasing me. I can kind of hear like 
stuff. Uh, 27. Let's go. 27. There we go. Easy peasy. Um, <laughs> I, I'm kind of scared for these next questions. I feel like they're going to throw me some curveball. So I think there was a penalty for wrong answers. I don't get penalties, but I haven't made a wrong answer yet. So maybe like I should have just chosen the manager, right? I am actually legitimately running out of time, I think. Uh, which is scary. We've gotten so far and I could just see the time counting down before my very eyes. Please let it be the exit next. Come on. Kind of hoping it is counting down very fast. Okay. Oh, oh, hi. Hi there. That was not cool. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, we made it back. It says zero. Is this not the normal area? Okay. There's another key. What's this? If you're seeing this, then you're pretty much home free at this point. Room zero always has a short path that leads back into the real world. As for me, I'd like to put all my experiences at Warrington behind me, but my conscien conscience won't rest until this whole situation has been resolved. What? If I go to public with my knowledge, corporate would have my head on a silver platter. I mean, legally, I mean, I, I signed an NDA. For now, I will continue to wage my secret war from these shadows until, uh, wait, until I can find my next course of action so somebody's in here with me. It says, hopefully these notes will be of some use until then. Sign the whistleblower. Okay, okay. So I don't know what to do now. So he said a short path, right? Is he still standing here? He is not. Let's go. All right, we're just gonna run. Oh, there's no timer. Okay. What does that mean? So, we're running into the real world now, I think. I don't know if I should be scared of what's behind me or not, but we're running. Oh wait, we made it. Oh, okay. I was scared there was gonna be some sort of chase scene at the end there I wasn't prepared for, but it seems like we're good. All right, so here's the ending cutscene, I think. Albert, if you don't come out <laughs> from there, they just ain't stay your ground for a month. My co-worker's trying to find him in there right now. I, I know she'll bring him out ASAP, ma'am. Oh yeah, how long has time passed? Because I know that time goes differently, right? Albert, why in heaven's name did you go running off like that? Sorry, ma. <laughs> okay, it won't happen again. Well, I would hope not, young man. Thank you both for your help. I swear he's usually so well behaved. Think nothing of it, man. It happens so off more often than you think in here. What? Is like, oh, is that so? Well, that case, we better get out of your hair then. Let's go, Albert. Okay. Okay, so is this seriously the ending? Usually there's some like, you know, weird ending story thing, right? So it continues to go on. For us, you were only gone a few minutes, so things didn't get out of hand. Um, I wonder what the ending is. Hey, Penny, uh, we can't keep doing this forever. One day, one of us is going to mess up. Ooh. So, I guess that's the end. It's kind of just an ominous someday the captain will win, right? Or I guess, <gasps> yep, is I. <laughs> he just winks in the end. I feel like it was kind of just like an adorable ending. Like, <laughs> All right, hold on. So here's the ending that I promised. I wanted to see what happens if you literally do nothing. I walked in, turned around. My manager's just staring at me like, all right, go. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> and I'm just standing here like, I don't want to. I don't want to go. I'm good. Oh, I've never actually seen it red. Okay, so it's about to... I guess the time is about to be up. So let's see what happens. Here we go. Okay, what happens? So, as an ominous line of red zeros flashed across Ashley's screen, she knew all too well that her own fate had been sealed. Despite knowing deep down that such an effort would be futile, she decided to venture deeper into the labyrinth. Perhaps she would have inadvertently found a new, previously undiscovered exit, or perhaps every inch she crawled would only dig herself further into a cold and colorful grave. She continued on for what felt like days, slowly losing both hope and battery life in equal measure, as the final percentage of her phone's battery life burned, its light began to flicker, and as the last bit of light that separated her from eternal darkness faded, and that's when she heard it. The unmistakable sound of wood scraping against plastic grew ever closer. Ooh, what? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, what? Neither the child or Ashley were ever seen again. The Warrington Burger Corporation denies any potential wrongdoing regarding the incident. Whoa, that is an intense ending. But uh, yeah, there you go. So that, that is what happens when you literally just break the game by standing in the beginning. You're just like, mm, nah, I'm not gonna play. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you subscribed. Hey, if you haven't subscribed already, do it with uh, your uh, uh, wrists. How, how do you do that? <laughs>
But then, hey, I welcome you to the DAC pack as we go towards 3 million subscribers. I thank God every day I'm able to do things like this, and I hope to make a smile every single day. So I'll see you in that next episode. Probably coming up right now. I'll see you there. Thank you guys for watching. And as always, peace out, my dudes.